So if you are, in, in our language we'll say conjuice. If you are compromising in giving, you will also compromise while receiving. Truly, this is my testimony. Where will you give? You will give on the altar. You will give in the place of giving. Hallelujah. If you are salaried person, if you are self-employed and you want to prosper, you will have to give. That giving is known as charity, the Christ's love. The love of God. The soul that you have is also living. As I am speaking this, your soul, your mind is of the Lord. Earlier it was trapped by human mindset, human thinking. I will not give. I will not do this enough. Enough. How much will I give? So if you are, in, in our language we'll say conjuice. If you are compromising in giving, you will also compromise while receiving. Truly, this is my testimony. The moment I sense that compromising while giving is also compromising while receiving. I don't compromise while giving. So I don't compromise while receiving as well. In every moment, in every word, I am giving you the seed. I am sowing the seed. It is a prophetic seed. I am sowing in your heart, in your spirit womb. But are you receptive? Are you the fertile ground to receive it? When you are sowing the seed, I am the fertile ground. I receive it. But when the prophetic word is entering you, are you the fertile ground to receive the prophecies? Or you are just listening them? So you listen, after some time you start doubting God. But you forget that you have heard it. You must repeatedly hear the word of God, repeatedly hear and keep on receiving these videos. Even one minute videos, I listen them to receive them for one month and continuously. I must be sure that I have received this prophetic word. Even if it is one minute clip, if I have to receive the prophetic word, even my own prophetic word, I keep on receiving the word for one month, two months, three months, or even for one year. Till the time in my deep within, I know I am full of this word. But what you people are doing, you're listening. This is not music to listen. This is the fire. This is the blood of the Lord. The blood of the Lamb, you can simply hear and listen. You must receive it. So you must hear and hear and hear and hear from this year and this year. And it should not go here into your head. It should go into your heart. The heart that is of the Spirit. Glory be to God alone. You must know how the spiritual realm works. And stop blaming the prophets. You must rectify the problem within you. Hallelujah. The first thing you must say that you will never ever blame anyone. Find what is the problem within you. Find where are you going wrong and where is the lacking within you. Correct yourself. Not this person and that person. Not this prophet and that pastor. They are doing their job. We are doing our job. We, are, we know why I am here. I know I am being led. I am brought by the Lord here. I am bought by the precious blood of the Lamb. And you must also know that you are also bought by the precious blood of the Lamb. And when you're bought by the precious blood of the Lamb, you know the value of it. You know the righteousness. So live in the righteousness. Hallelujah. Live in the righteousness. The righteous living, it is the living in Christ. Hallelujah. Lord is my shepherd. I shall not be in want. We thank all those who are honoring the Lord with their wealth and for all the offerings. We bless you with a hundredfold of return. My beloved ones, if you have not yet received our Lord God Jesus Christ, if you have not yet received the Holy Spirit, we shall pray a small prayer because this repentance is at hand. Our Father in heaven, we come into your presence to our Lord Jesus Christ. And today we receive salvation. We receive Holy Spirit into our heart. Oh Lord, forgive us our sins and help us to be born again. We shall seek you, O Lord Jesus Christ, unto Zion. In Jesus' mighty name, amen. My beloved ones, with this small prayer of repentance, your sins are forgiven and you have received Holy Spirit within you. You shall walk the walk of righteousness.